In this video, we'll take a look at creating a basic program in BirdBlocks while looking at some of the functions that make the app user-friendly. Before we get started, make sure that you have an LED plugged into your Hummingbird board on port 1. We'll need it for this program. Back in BirdBlocks, go into your robot blocks and grab an LED block by selecting and dragging one into the work area. To get a better view of our program as we work, you can zoom in or out of the work area by pinching and dragging on your tablet to change the look. To light your LED, we have to adjust the value of the block. Before making any adjustments, make sure that the block is set to the correct port by clicking on the drop-down menu and selecting port 1. To edit the value of our LED block, tap on it and a number pad will appear. You can set the value to any number ranging between 0 and 100. Press the check mark to close the number pad when you are done. Now let's add a control block to our work area. Select and drag the when flag tapped block and attach it to our LED block. Now when the green flag at the top of the screen is tapped, it will light our LED. Let's add to our program by adding a wait block. This will delay our program by a number of seconds before moving on to the next action. To finish our program, let's also add another LED block and leave the value at zero. This will cause your light to blink on and off. Test your program by tapping the green flag. Now say you've added a block that you're not sure you want to keep in the program. You can delete the block by selecting it and dragging it off like so. You can also undo your delete action by selecting the trash can with an undo arrow next to the green flag at the top of the screen. It will appear at the top left of your work area and you can drag and snap it back into place. And that wraps up creating a basic program. In the next and final video, we'll take a look at saving and exporting your programs.